guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I have got a doll's kill haul for you today. My camera is angled correctly today. My apologies, I didn't even realize that in the last video it was like to the side until I was editing. But I have got a ginormous bag that says Claire's on it that has all my doll's kill stuff in it. I've got another bag beside me as well, but it's an actual bag. So if you've been following my Instagram, you probably know what it is. But let's just dive right in to this haul. All right, so the first items I'm gonna show you guys were our pants. And I was watching Queen Jelly Beanie's video on her haul, and she bought these pants in pink, and I was like, oh, that's really cute. But she said that when she bent over, like, she couldn't bend over, and I would have to agree with her after wearing them for an entire weekend. Like, you can bend, like, like if this is the body, you can bend like this, and that's it. You can't bend over to your toes. No siree, no. But, it is from the brand called Love Too True, and I got them in pink and blue because I could not decide which color to get it in, and I also need more cute pants. So they are just this really, really cute, like plaid pants. I've been wearing them a lot, so the bottoms are like done how I like. Uh, they are just freaking adorable, and of course, my little self had to get them in another color as well. I've been wearing them with my pink belt. And if you follow me on Instagram, you have seen pictures of these already. I don't know if I've posted the pink ones, but I've definitely posted with the blue ones. It's like, it's my WC sweaters all over again. I got the cardigan and the sweater, but these pants are just too cute. There will be a try on part of the video, but these pants are adorable. So Sugar Thrills has been releasing so many cute things recently and I saw this and I didn't really want it to begin with but then I kept seeing other people doing it and fashion influencers and I'm like well I guess I need it and then when I showed it to my friend Vic she was like how many like horizontal sweaters within like a rainbow colorway do you need and I'm like obviously all of them so I got the sugar thrills like crop rainbow tea it's like I'm wearing the same one like you can't tell when it's at the purple like this is the same top no it's not but I got the crop top sugar thrills it is like a knitted sweater it is definitely one of those sweaters that I feel like is gonna pill which sucks but oh well I have worn it a bunch already as I've mentioned this has been sitting in my room so of course I'm going to wear it but they are clean I swear it is just so cute I love it so much. The sleeves are chunkier color block, which I thought was absolutely adorable. So, got that top. And then to go with this top was the Sugar Thrills, like, blue satin shorts. Also, I got these in a small, because waist-wise I am a small, and they fit nice along the waist, but these are booty shorts. Like, my booty was out. My There was... Lots of booty <laughs> being out. These are not a day-to-day -day shorts if you are wanting to wear them like downtown and to your mall. No, no. I would wear these to a beach and like maybe do some photos in them, but it is not a shorts unless I was wearing like leggings with them that I would wear just shorts by itself. At least for myself personally. Uh, I won't let my booty hang out, but they are so cute. They are really, really soft. Uh, they are very like satiny so of course the light is reflecting it but it's got this nice little white pattern there and it's got that all the way around they are very comfortable very soft so I size small and I got this one in a size medium and it is very very comfy also from sugar thrills I got which looks like a crumpled mess right now. And I, again, I told Vic, I'm like, I got this. And she's like, you literally are like the most to yourself person. You're gonna wear that. And I'm like, I will wear it for photos. Is the Sugar Thrills like bow bra. Like, that's really cute. I got this in a size small. It fits perfectly. Um, Cause I don't wear a bra with it. I just wear it on my boobs, but it's just really cute. Okay, like, like, Yes, okay, that just, that would be cute for photos. And it also goes really cute with the Love Too True pants, like just this and like the pants. So, um, photos coming soon, yes. I'm moving on, also, a From Dolls Kill, but from 
current mood. So Pride season is right around the corner. Of course, I have all my rainbow sweaters. I have rainbow tops. I have extreme rainbow dresses. I have rainbow cardigans and all that. But I'm like, hey, for Pride this year, I want to be like, like a lot of my stuff is pastel rainbow. So I'm like, I need like the classic rainbow. Yes. So I just got like a rainbow tube top in the harsher kind of rainbow because I've been playing with like harsher colors and not just pastels because I live in pastels. I also just wanted the free shipping and this was like six dollars and I'm like what the heck that's cute. So I got like the pride flag basically like this is just like fabric. Um, I got it in a size small it fits again really well. It is like swimsuit material uh, so it's like very slidey. It is really stretchy which is nice so very stretchy, could use as a slingshot, but I really like it. I think it's cute. I think for $6 to get my free shipping, worth it, so bam. Okay, so this next set, it is a set, is from Current Mood, and when I saw them come out with it, I was so shook. I needed it really bad, and then when I went to go see it, it was sold out, and so I put my like email on like the we'll email you when it's back babe and they never emailed me so I check weekly and then when I checked one time they it was back in stock but there was only like a few size like a few left in my size so you know that I snatched that up right away and that is the current mood like Chinese Tokyo Nights set because I almost peed myself they are so beautiful Oh my god, look at the covers. It literally looks neon. I kid you not, this is like how it looks. But that is so dang cool. Hi, I want to live forever in this set. Like, what? And then I also got, of course, the pants because, oh my gosh, I was going to get the boots and the purse that matched, but the purse just looked kind of funny and I wasn't about it, but like the jacket and the pants, yes. So I got them in, I got the jacket in a medium and it fits nice. It is crop, it is a little longer because I normally would go small, but it fits really nice. The sleeves are a nice length. And then I believe I got the pants in a small because my waist is a 26. Yes, a small, but like, hi. Call me when you're on like the strip because oh my gosh, these pants are freaking amazing. These are so cool, oh my gosh. Okay, now that this bag is empty, I have two other things. One was to get the free shipping and one was because I could not resist and I needed it extremely badly. So, the free shipping. We got another pair of shoes. Good job, Jade, you caved. I have not tried them on yet, so I have no idea if they fit. It is way past the return exchange date. I know all of you are thinking, wow, that's smart of you, and I'm like, yeah. Because I just, I knew I was going to be filming soon, so. <laughs> it is from the brand, I want to say that says Cupid. And it was because the brand YRU was out of the shoes in my size that I wanted. So I'm like, these are a dang close second and they were the 20 bucks to get my free shipping. So, they are, wow, new shoe smell. Hello. They are just like a holographic runner. They are more on the orangey side. I don't know if you can tell, but they are not like the bluey holographic. They are the orangey holographic. And I wanted it because I want to have some like cute sporty looks. And I don't really have like like runners. Like you know with like the white on the bottom. It's got to have the white on the bottom for it to be considered a runner. Like I have runner-esque shoes like sneakers, but they're not like, you know sports ones. <laughs> I don't sports for anyone who probably can tell that like you would not wear these doing sports but I am very excited for these. I will give you a try on. I believe I got them in a size 8. I always size up. I am a seven and a half, and generally size 8's from Dolls Kill no matter what the brand fit me well. Yes, I am very excited. Uh, they do feel like th it is that kind of material that will like hopefully conform to your foot after you wear it a while. Um, the stitching looks nice. It's got that nice shoe smell which I like. Yeah, I might change the laces but 
it looks like a nice shoe. I'm very excited. Okay, the reason, that whole reason why I got the shoes, I'm like, the whole reason why I got the whole haul to get my free shipping, no, the reason why I got the shoes was so I could get this bag. Now y'all know, you all know, know, uh, that I am going to Japan soon. I have mentioned that little so much in my Instagrams, on my Twitters, everywhere. And I bought new luggage last year because I just didn't like the luggage that I have, so I got some off of Amazon. It's pink, it's lovely, I love it. But Sugar Thrills came out with a suitcase that my little heart could not resist. And so of course, I had to get it. This is possibly the greatest carry-on I will ever own. Excuse me, Sugar Thrills. Hi, you just marketed me in a freaking suitcase. Oh my gosh. I, when I saw this, was like, that needs to be my carry-on. I need to roll through the airport with this bag and have every person looking at me saying, oh my gosh, it's one of those. Just kidding. Um, extra, I love it so much. I remember going to pick this up at the post office. They didn't actually drop it off at my house because the box that it came in was like my arm length, which is vaguely long. And I, I was like, I asked the post guy, I'm like, can I open it here? Like I knew it was inside the box. And he's like, oh yeah, sure. And I opened it. I remember everyone at the post office was like, that is so extra and we love it. And I'm like, Bye, as I have like the freaking luggage in my hand, just like I'll see y'all later. And it was great and I loved it, but it is so nice. I have used this bag a few times. I went and did a photo shoot, so it has actually like stuff in it right now. Um, it's got my skirt and, oh, there's the lipstick I was looking for. Some water and all that, but it is so nice. Here, I'm like, let's pull out my garbage so that I can actually show you the inside of the suitcase. Um, it was a I'm going on vacation kind of photo shoot. So the inside is extremely roomy. Um, to test the inside, I tried and see like how many pairs of shoes I could fit in here. I was able to fit like all three of my platform shoes in here, plus four other pairs of like my sneakers. And you know, platforms are big, like they're like, they that big. So like this holds a lot. It is carry-on size. So if you wanted to use this as a carry-on, you definitely can. Uh, it's absolutely amazing. It's got a little zipper pocket here, which I have not used because I just don't need anything in there, but it is fairly big, which is awesome. It also has a zipper compartment in here as well, right here. And then on the other side, it also has like pocket parts here and there. It has the zipper along the bottom, if you can see, there to access like the wheels and the other part there because it is an actual freaking suitcase. So in this part here, because they like to hide the ugly part, is bam, the handle so that you can freaking roll your amazing thing around at the airport, which is phenomenal because you all know that I want to be an extra bench while I'm in the airport. Yes! And it also has this little niche notch thing here. Um, I think that's so that you can like close these handles together. That's what I've been using it for. So that like, there, now they're attached and are not flinging all over the place, which I think is really handy. But all right, so without further ado, here is the try-on section of the video. Okay, please excuse my mess. I need to clean my room and then the room tour will be coming. But here are the pants. So I rolled them up just at the bottom so that they are nice like, but the waist is perfect. I got them in a size small from the brand Love Too True. They were a UK brand, so I was a little nervous on how the sizing would be, but they're great. But yeah, as Queen Jelly Beanie said, yeah, I can't go farther than this, so I can't put socks on. I have to put my socks on before my pants or I won't be able to reach it. Hi, I just think they're so cute. With the belt would be adorable. Look how cute they are. Here they are in blue. Boom. Bah. Here they are in the blue. So I haven't got them rolled up at the moment. 
just because I haven't worn them in a little bit, so they've been sitting in my dresser. But I do think the roll up does look a little cuter, at least for myself personally, because these pants are a little on the longer side. I did notice with the blue that even a small, it was a little bit more roomy. That's just manufacturing. So I do wear the blue ones with a belt. Again, I can get a little farther with this one. I can get a little lower, but hi, these pants are adorable and I love them. They're very cute and I can wear them to work. Yes, oh, very cute. So here is the Sugar Thrills top. It is super cute. It is the crop top there. I have it in a medium and the sleeves are a little long for me, but that's okay. I think the oversized sleeve look is freaking adorable as heck. I also have the shorts on. As I've mentioned, they are booty shorts, so I probably won't turn around for you because my butt will be hanging out. But here is the front of the shorts. Okay, so here is the front of the shorts. You can already tell probably that these are heckin' short. Like, I just want to, like, pull them down. Um, I'm just gonna cover. But, like, hi, this where I'm grabbing my butt's hanging out. So, they are very, very short. But at least they're cute for, like, the beach because that'd be fine. But, yeah, um, that's a lot of booty that I don't want to show, so... Just a heads up if you want to get these shorts. Uh, yeah, they're very much a booty short, so. Yup, be wary. All right, so here is the like night scene denim set. I love this set so much. I'm like trying to do full body, but I can't really, but it is so cute. You can tell right here that it is a crop. These sleeves are again a little long. I think a medium actually was the proper size for me, um, or it might not have because it, maybe that was supposed to be there. Yeah, I probably needed a small, but whatever. I think it's heckin' adorable, and I'm so glad that I was able to snatch it up. The whole set together is just the coolest freaking thing like hello living my best edgy life oh my gosh who am I like I blend right into the background because this mess doesn't help with that mess except this mess is amazing but hi I think this is so cute with my like black boots I think this is a hashtag Luke and I love it I think this is so cool oh my gosh I love it so much. Like, I'm like just wearing black and like this mush of pastel. Oh no, did I get lipstick on my sweater? <gasps> but this is the set and I love it. <laughs> all right guys, well that is it for this haul. I had so much fun filming it. I am so glad that I could actually wear all this stuff now and not having to worry about filming a video and making sure it's all clean. I'm excited to roll down the airport in the most, with the most extra freaking carry on ever. Yes. And of course, if you haven't, make sure to head over to my Instagram and my Twitter where I've been posting sneak peeks and previews and just fun photos about explaining my trip to Japan and other fun things. So make sure to go check those out. And of course, I will see you in the next video. 